Hello and welcome! If you're watching this video, it's probably because you're on my channel, which should be draining. If it's not draining, then it's not my channel, so this is a really pointless intro for whoever stole that video. But, hey, what is up? Uh, we're gonna be looking at Snap Maws today. These are big old crocodile, alligator, whichever one you want to go with. Enemies in Horizon Zero Dawn. They take a crap ton of hits, and I'm gonna give you the best way to take them down. Or at least the most ideal way to take them down. You're not always going to get into situations like these, but if you do, make sure you make use of it. So, you see where I am on the map here, and we're going to be killing some snap maw that are to the south of me right now. They're just by this little island. There's three of them. Now, this is the first time I've actually encountered them, but it's a very efficient way. So, I had just bought the marksman bow, or the blue marksman bow, the one that has uh, corruption and normal rounds. And looking at them, corruption doesn't do anything special on them, so I was like, hey, you know what? I'm just gonna shoot them. Now, they have a few weak spots. They have two little freeze canisters on their head, and they have a little uh, belly thing below their throat, which actually explodes if you kill it, and it freezes them. So, it's really hard to hit, especially when they're in the water, but if you can hit it, it pays off, which I do in the end here, hit it on one of the snap mods. They shoot a ranged attack, uh, very similar to the Bellowback, and it's ranged uh, fire plume or freeze plume, depending on uh, which one you're attacking. And so it's super easy to dodge, but they usually go in sets of four, so make sure you roll, 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 and keep on rolling the same direction, because if you roll back in the direction where one landed, you're actually going to be hit by the subsequent one that the snap maw shot. You should be able to get one or two, three maybe shots off from the marksman bow before they shoot again, and even if they're swimming your way, you still have a lot of time. Now, I know what you're thinking. Well, what do I do if they're on land? Easiest thing, and I say this for almost every creature, is the freaking blast trip caster. It's not always guaranteed, but it has a higher chance of actually damaging and even ruining that component for that little belly thing that they have. So if you do that, it brings an extra advantage uh, on top of the extra damage it already does. So I'd recommend doing that if that is exactly what you are facing and they're on land. Now, I don't know what happened here. I think they got stuck on some of their dead compatriots, and that's why they uh, started leaving. But it also was like a little bit of an AI flaw, because like, in the middle of swimming to me, they just decided to give up the chase, which was uh, a little bit heartbreaking, actually. I wanted to really get into a good battle, but it is what it is. Can't really complain. So, like I said, you really want to hit the belly, but the canisters on the top of the head are also beneficial to hit too, since they do do a lot of extra damage. If you hit the belly and it explodes, it makes them all brittle, which if you don't know your elemental status effects, uh, it makes them, it looks like they're covered in ice, and you do extra, extra damage to them, which means it's a very vital thing to do. Now, you can use freeze arrows in them, you can use your sling, um, but if you can make them do that to themselves and spare your elemental ammo, that can be pretty vital. Once you're done killing them, you loot their bodies, etc, etc, and uh, there you go. Now you feel accomplished because you killed some snap mods. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already for more Horizon Zero Dawn content, as well as Let's Plays and stuff that I do as well. Thank you so much for watching, my name is Draining, and I'll see you next time.